Hello friends, in today's video we're gonna be changing a uh, brake uh, drum cylinder uh, on this Peugeot 206. So we're just gonna crack on with it. Right, just going to take this cap off here to get to the main uh, nut. straighten this uh, nut from here okay that's where it gets locked so we're gonna straighten it with a flathead screwdriver and then we're gonna undo it okay so this is a 32 mil uh, nut to undo The condition of the brake shoe on this car they look alright so it's just the just the hydraulic cylinder here which is uh, leaking oil as you can see here and it's leaking oil really badly that's why it failed on MOT so that's what we're gonna be changing we bought uh, the new ones for 15 pound each from our local shop what we'll do is we'll uh, dismantle the dismantle the shoe first, both sides. Yeah, and we're gonna try to pull out the whole unit without uh, undoing the springs. We're gonna undo these uh, locking uh, pins. So what we're gonna do is we're gonna push it in and then turn it anti-clockwise, and that's how it comes off one side it's gonna do the other side again push it in and then turn it clockwise there we go that's that done nicely now we'll have to remove the actual shoe for that what we're gonna do one side this is the other side okay so we'll keep the whole thing hanging down like this now we'll have to go at the back of the drum just here right so at the back of the drum what we're gonna do is we're gonna undo this brake uh, pipe uh, nut in order to disengage the whole cylinder we'll have to undo these two bolts two 10 mil bolts by undoing these two bolts the whole cylinder will come apart so to start off with the uh, i gonna undo the uh, brake pipe first right to undo the nut we'll have to use a 11 mil spanner right we're going to be using uh, a 10 mil uh, socket to undo the uh, the cylinder right just gonna do the the second uh, nut Okay, that 
pass one of them out. We are just going to undo the brake pipe now. I mean, I did uh, loosen it, but I'm going to disengage it now so that I can uh, pull the cylinder out. That's the pipe disengaged. So now, now we're going to use a flat edge chisel to bang it out. There you go, that's the cylinder out of the way. Right, this is the new cylinder. Light for light. Right, there we go. Before I put the cylinder in, I'm gonna clean the the whole uh, area with the brake cleaner fluid okay, that's good enough there we go that's how the cylinder goes in Right. Just gonna tighten the brake pipe. Now the bolts one. Just gonna scale the cylinder now. There we go. Not not too tight because uh, it's gonna uh, break. It has happened to me before where I tightened it, over tightened it and then the nut, uh, uh, I mean the, bo uh, the bolt just uh, snapped, there we go, okay now what I'm going to do is, I'm going to tighten the brake pipe once again, that's good enough Okay, so now we're gonna put the uh, shoe back. Okay, so before we put it back, we're just gonna give it a good clean with the brake cleaner. So I'm gonna scale the, the left hand side. There we go, that's one side done, so now we'll do the other side, and for that we will be using a flat edge screwdriver. There we go, I'm going to scale 
video this again on this side this one here there we go that's that in place as well So we're just going to put the big washer in first and then uh, the nut goes in. we're gonna do is we're gonna tighten it with the breakers bar there we go that's good enough so the last thing is to uh, crimp the edge of the nut that done okay so the last bit is to bleed the braking system right just gonna put the dust cap back on. and now we're gonna put the wheel back on There we go, job done. Thank you very much for watching the video.